film a morning routine today where it's going to be super productive and I show you guys kind of my morning routine habits in this new spring season. So I think the first thing I'm going to do is work out. Let's get going. <laughs> with you guys it's probably been half a year or probably a year now since I've actually have worked out I don't know why I've definitely fallen out of it but in this routine I definitely want to strive to be like the best of myself after I go on a run I also want to try a Pilates workout which I've been seeing everywhere all over TikTok and I genuinely want to give it a try just because it seems so fun and there's like at home workouts you can do so hopefully this inspires me to just kind of get back into it but I kind of wanted to put this in here just to let you guys know that like it's okay to sometimes just fall out of your routine it doesn't even need to be working out literally it could be something different I try not to compare myself to the person I used to be because that's just not healthy and every day is a new start so we're taking it one step at a time and hopefully it's fun because I miss it I think I'm going to get a little bite to eat before I get running and then after I work out I'll cook a whole entire breakfast and everything It's a 25 minute workout and I thought like almost 30 minutes that would be kind of long But honestly it went by so so fast personally I really liked it as like a beginner. It was like a more intense version of yoga It was kind of zen at times, but then at other times it got kind of difficult I personally liked it and I think I'm going to continue doing the class anyways now I'm gonna make some breakfast I'm thinking about making avocado toast as usual and then a protein like smoothie thing <laughs> kombucha company just sent me a package and this really really nice handwritten letter so we're gonna open it it's like this huge freezer thing honestly it's so cool that they did this we're gonna see what they sent <laughs> literally seen me drink this in like one of my get ready with me videos it's one of my favorite flavors the sacred life so so grateful thank you so much gt's their synergy kombucha brand is so good it's literally my favorite kombucha they sent their new flavor bloom this is like their new seasonal flavor my sister and i are very very excited to try it's like our favorite thing to do we just like to go to the store buy a bunch of kombucha but now we have literally 12 whole bottles they also sent other things that aren't their kombucha like i didn't even know they had these like mushroom elixirs from their brand which is super super cool these look really yummy as well thank you okay guys i just got back from the kitchen and now i'm actually going to change into my bathing suit and then sit out on the patio and do some tanning because the uv is pretty high and i also just checked the weather and it's like 90 degrees out almost which is so weird because it was a lot cooler this morning but it's getting pretty hot now i'm gonna put on a little bathing suit go out there and then i'm also gonna read my book i just started this new book and so far i don't have any thoughts on it yet just because i quite literally just started it but i'm gonna read a little bit while i'm out there i also really like to listen to podcasts while i'm tanning and one of the podcasts I've recently have been listening to is Fernanda Ramirez's podcast. It's called A Better You. Highly recommend this podcast. I love her so, so much. And she just talks about really like super motivating topics. And then I also want to journal a little bit, but that might just be too much. I'm not going to be out for that long, just an hour because I have other stuff I need to do today. And then also I don't want to burn. Let's get going. <music> literally died 
because I was trying to vlog, but I'm gonna put my tanning oil on. Highly recommend this stuff. It's good if you're trying to get tan. And then I also like to use the Sun Bum like hair lightener stuff. I just sprayed it in my hair and it just helps it get lighter. These are like my two favorite summer products. I feel like summer is finally here, guys. It's like 90 degrees outside, even though it's still spring, but it feels like June right now. I wish the pools were open. Also, my cats are currently out here with me too. I just feel like this is such a like typical chill spring morning with me. It's probably my sixth time doing this within the last like couple of weeks. I just feel so good after being out in the sun. So she loves to hang out in the sun with me. And also I have a spray bottle here because it gets so hot and I like to spray myself with some cold water. <laughs> slightly crooked but i'm gonna start doing my makeup i just got out of the shower i'm like extremely sweaty even after like ending my shower with like a cold shower i'm still hot i'm just gonna do some light makeup it's like early afternoon now also just because today's kind of a chill day i hope you guys realize that with this morning routine this is more of like what i do when i have a lot of time to myself because obviously i can't tan from like 11 30 a.m to like 2 30 p.m like every day this is normally what i do on like my off days when i don't have like a lot of homework or when I don't have like something to do where that kind of cuts between my schedule and like obviously that's why I can't really do that so this is what I do when I have like a lot more time and I'm just trying to make it like a chill morning I'm also gonna try to do like a super natural base makeup look today I don't know how that's normally gonna go because normally when I try to do an all natural makeup look I somehow just end up doing a full face I don't know if anyone else is like that but every time I say I'm gonna go light with my makeup I end up doing a full face obviously when I have time I'm not super rushed right now so I probably will just end up doing my full makeup routine if you guys are curious on what my makeup routine is like i'm not gonna walk you guys through it in this video just because i did do a whole get ready with me like makeup tutorial video and it's on my channel i'll put it up in the eye i'll just link it down below as well for you guys if you want to follow my makeup routine in a more detailed kind of way <laughs> wet which is kind of annoying me just because i feel like it looks weird yeah this is super simple literally took me 12 minutes so now i'm all ready for the day which feels great and we're gonna get on to the next thing <laughs> going out and eating lunch although i just got it to go and i ate it in my room as you guys briefly saw but i'm actually going to go out again because i have more errands to run they're like fun errands so i thought i would videotape this i need to go to ulta just to get some makeup and stuff like that i've been out of a few things like eyebrow gel powder and then i also need to go to walmart to buy some more shampoo conditioner and i think my dad said i needed to get cat food as well so let's get going <laughs> Okay guys, I'm finally back home. I was out for a bit and just finished running some errands. I'm now going to kind of just chill and do some homework and editing. I have to get ahead of my homework because I'm actually going on a very last minute day trip to New York tomorrow to tour some colleges, which you guys are all gonna see in an upcoming video. But I'm briefly just gonna show you guys what I got. So I went to Ulta and then Marshalls first just to kind of get some beauty products. From Ulta, I first just got the Anastasia Beverly Hills Clear Brow Gel. My brow hairs are all over the place without this stuff, so got this and then at marshall's i ended up getting this stuff i've never used this brand before but i needed a new purple shampoo to just kind of tone my hair and i'm out of mine right now so i just got this like cheap one from marshall's honestly i love browsing the marshall's like beauty section it's honestly crazy some of the good stuff you find there i was not planning to buy this but i also found a bamboo scalp massager this is one of those things where it's like i've seen it everywhere and i've been meaning to buy it for the longest time but never really like remember to but i found one there and i I was like, oh my gosh, I've been looking for something like this for a while. You just use it in the shower and just 
It reduces dandruff, promotes healthy blood flow. I don't know, I've seen so many good things about this like on TikTok, so excited to try that. Lastly, from Walmart, I just got really boring stuff. I first got cat food, like I said, and then I also got my shampoo and conditioners, and then these pimple patches. These are the best ones ever. I thought I would film later, but never did, so that concludes today's video. I hope you all enjoyed. Follow me on Instagram at CaitlinDeWitt underscore, and subscribe to my channel if you want to. We are getting so close to 300k. Also, comment below this emoji if you made it up to the end. I love you guys so much, and see you soon. Bye! Bye.